Hi guys, this is just a comparison of some of the commercial software that you can get to for defrags. Uh, this is a response to Jimmy Arcom's video on the automa automation of defragging and speeding up your computer, basically. Uh, I've got three different pieces of software here. I've got Owendo Defrag, Perfect Disk, and Ultimate Defrag. I'll be going through the resource usages of each one, what they do, and the automation of each one. If we start with uh, Ultimate Defrag, uh, before I start, I've got this whacked into full screen uh, for a reason, which I will show you later. There's something pretty cool that I like on one of the pieces of software. So if we start with Ultimate Defrag, maximize it. As you can see, there's a pretty little diagram here of the disk. It shows you some information on the actual blocks that it's showing you uh, by megabytes and clusters. I've got a legend here showing you all the, what all the colours mean. Uh, shows the drives up here. We've got a C drive and a D drive. What we'll do is we'll analyse the C drive because that's my recovery partition. My D drive's quite a lot bigger, so that will take a lot more time. So if we just analyse the C drive now, we've got some statistics here. We've got a file count, it tells you how many contiguous files there are and fragmented files there are, and the degree of fragmentation, which is 3.751. Then this pretty little diagram shows you what, what the locations of all the contiguous files and fragmented files on the disk. Then you've got the different versions of defrags that it does, which is fairly, fairly handy. Uh, I believe you can schedule it, tool schedule. You can, you can schedule an automatic version. This, is, this just looks fairly basic. The whole program looks basic, which is, which is great if you want it to do anything. If you just want it to do what, you, what, if it does what you want it to do, then that's fine. That's what I'm trying to say. <laughs> um, in terms of resource usage, UDFrag is using 21 megabytes at the moment, and that's just after its analysis of my dri my disk. Even that's that. If we head on to Perfect Disk, Perfect Disk. Uh, looks looks fairly much looks like it does exactly the same thing. You've got analysis here. There's the C drive. It takes a little bit longer than um, Ultimate did. Uh, it gives you a recommendation. It pops up with some statistics. Gives you a recommendation. Your drive is in good condition. No defragmentation passes are needed. Uh, basically, it shows you some statistics, and pie charts, and such and such. Seems fairly fairly useful. Shows you a little help thing here of what what everything does. You can also get this to automate if you go to autom autopilot schedule. You got a choice of one time, daily, weekly. I've already, I already had it set as a screensaver uh, earlier when I tried it out. Uh, you can well, which I can just edit. It's got a fairly simple wizard here, which um, basically says when do you want to run it, how long do you want to wait. Um, that's done by Rasco. So yeah, that's perfect disk. If we if we have analysed, if we go back to the anal analyst analysing, that yeah, after that's just analysed, we will check the resource usage here. Perfect disk. That's using fifty eight megabytes. So that's quite a bit more than the other one. Uh, if we head on to the O and O defrag, this is the one I mainly use. I've got 8.5. I know there's a version 10 available, but I think that's just that's just skinned. I haven't. Don't think I've seen any new features in it. I think it just looks uh, like vis vistified, if you understand what I mean. It just looks like Office 2003 um, skins been put on to this program. So uh, this one's pretty much uh, pretty much the same as the other ones. Really, you've got one button defrag, automated optimization. So it just does it all, analyzes and defragments it all in one go. Uh, if we analyse it now, that shows you what all. Uh, de degree of defragmentation is 3.75%, so that's handy. Uh, pretty much the same statistics as the other one, so I'm, I'm pretty happy about that. You can add a job here, you can get it to run on specific times, specific days, pretty much what Jimmy R explained with his scheduled tasks, but this actually does it for you, it looks like. Uh, now one thing I like about Owendo, if we just analyse the resource usage, uh, oh no, oh oh. Thanks for watching my video. Uh, feel free to comment and say see if you have any better software than me.
Um, thanks for watching my video. Please comment and rate. Thanks again.